only one model, and I try to approximate it to different places in each day time. Okay? Next day, remember, I'm going to approximate it to different places. Understand? You understand. Say we have 34, 34, um, 134, and 256 thousands, thousands, okay? We are going to approximate with the same method. One rule to all approximation for every place. Understand? First of all, we are going to approximate to the nearest ones. I'm going to approximate ones, tens, hundreds. Then I'm going to approximate ten thousand, hundred and thousands on the same number. In each time, I'm going number one, name each digit. Number one, name each digit. First of all, first of all, count from here. This is the center of the A, of the number. On the left hand side, from the point, start with ones, tens, hundreds. On the right hand side, from the point, start with tenth, hundredth, thousands. Okay? Now I ask you to approximate this number to the nearest one. First step, name each digit. I'm in the naming. Number two, underline the digit that you are going to approximate to its place. Again, underline the digit that you approximate to its place. And build a wall. And build a wall beside this digit. The first digit after the wall, whatever. Where is the wall? Where is the digit? It doesn't matter now. But the importance here, the first digit after the wall, zero, one, two, three, four, wait. Keep the number as it is. Keep the number as it is. If five, six, seven, eight, nine, raise the number by one. Increase the number by one. Here I have two. Two? Wait. That means I'm going to cancel all of them and keep the number as it is. Replace all digits. After the wall by zeros. Replace all digits after the wall by zeros. Approximately equals 134 as it is point zero, zero, zero. Keep it now. Keep it now. Number two. I'm going to approximate the same number to the nearest tens to the nearest tens set. I'm going to write it again. Keep distance between digits like this. Name each digit from the point. From the point, I'm going to name on the right hand side, left hand side from the point, start with ones, tens, hundred, tenth, hundred, and thousand. Okay? Here I'm going to underline the what? The, the digit that I'm going to approximate to its place. What is it? Tens. I'm going to underline the tens because I want to approximate this number to the nearest tens. Build a wall here where beside this tens digit. The first digit after the wall is four. Smaller than five. That means it is a wing. Keep the number as it is and replace all digits by zeros. Four. Never to increase the number.
number that means approximately equals 130.000. Keep it now. Number three, I'm going to approximate the same number to the nearest 100. Then I'm going to write it again with the same naming for each digit. What are they? Once, tens, hundred, ten, hundred, and thousands. Underline, number two, underline the determined digit that you are buying it to approximate to its place. Hundred, underline the hundred, build a wall beside the hundred. The first digit after the hundred is three. Three increase or not? Not increase, keep the number as it is and replace all of them, all digits by zeros. That means approximately equals 100.000. Understand? But in this place, the decimal place, how to approximate? By the same way. First of all, I'm going to name each digit number two. Underline the determined uh, digit that I'm going to approximate to its place. Number three, build a wall. The first digit after the wall. Five and greater than five, increase by one. Smaller than five, keep the number as it is and replace all digits by zeros. Time to shoot. 134 and 256 thousands. Naming each digit, tenths, hundreds, thousands, months, tens, hundreds. Now I ask you to approximate this number to the nearest tenth. Tenth. Tenth means the first digit after the point. The first digit after the point. That means I'm going to underline this tenth and build a wall on the right hand side from the Determine or, or underline the digit. The first digit after the wall is five. That means it will increase the two by one and replace these two digits only by zeros. That means approximately equals 134 and this two will be increased by one to give me three, zero, zero. Okay? 134 and 265 thousands. Name each digit. Once, tens, hundreds, ten, hundreds, thousands. Okay? Now I want you to approximate the same number to the nearest hundred. Hundred means the two digits. Two zeros. In a 
instead of 34 equal 1, not 100. It's too wrong. Understand? الموضوع كله متعلق بذاكرته ككيد صغير بيستخدم الدرس للمرة الأولى لو أنا علمته إن كارسل الدجس زي في الريس الزام بايزيروس هيجي في الجزء المول نمبر أو الانتجر هيكنسل ال 34 هيكنسل هنا ال 4 وهتبقى 13 مش 130 هيكنسل هنا ال 34 وهتبقى 1 مش 100 and so on بس لو هو حط لنا هنا زيروز هل ده غلط؟ هل ده غلط؟ لكن عمل لي كيبنج لمين؟ للزيروز الاساسيه. بعد الحصه الاولى والثانيه والثالثه علمه انه يعمل كنسله. اون ذا ليفت اون ذا رايت هاند سايد فروم ذا بايت ات دازنت ماتر تو كنسل اول ديجيتس. ويزاوت ريبليسنج ذيم باي زيروز. اندرستاند وات اي مين؟ اتس تو امبورتنت فور يور بيوبلز. اندرستاند؟ 